In this interesting episode, we are talking about the five interesting things. Number one, the league usually ends in May, but this year it might be prolonged because of the case between Kaza Chiefs and the PSL. Number two, Supersport United Ronan Williams have commented about young people at the club and uh, why the club is not winning. Number three, we are still at Supersport United. The coach has responded on what is going to happen next season. Is he going to be the coach because Benny McCarthy is linked with Supersport United? Number four, we are still in Pretoria. We are talking about Peter Shalulile. He's actually considered to be uh, the best striker in the African continent by far. Number five, we are in Orlando, on Orlando, where we are talking about Orlando Pirate player Justin Shabalala has attracted interest abroad. So I'm going to give you more about that. So if you are interested to know more about that, then please, please do stick around because we are about to discuss that. To those that will stick around, guys, if you are not yet subscribed, then what are you waiting for? Because the subscribe is free. To like the video, it is free. To comment in the comment section below, guys, it is free of charge. So where do we begin? Let's start in Pretoria before we want to we want to come back to the Kaiser Chiefs issue. So we want to start in Pretoria. When we are done in Pretoria, Ronan Williams, uh, Kaitano Tembo, um, Kaitano Tembo, and Peter Shalulile, they do not want to come back to Joburg because those are the those are Pretoria stories, by the way. So let's jump into Pretoria. We are talking about well, we are talking to Ronan Williams right now. Ronan Williams was asked about the young, the contribution of young people and why the team is not winning. And uh, what, what seems to be the problem currently, and Ronan Williams has responded by saying the following. He says that, um, he says that it is difficult, very difficult, because they need the experience uh, to, to guide them. And that at, the, at the some, moment of, uh, some moment, our starting lineup is made out of a lot of 20 to 21 years of, of age. And it's difficult because they are still in their learning phases. But... That is where you grow. You don't you don't learn by sitting in the stands. So they are going to get better and we will challenge for things. Maybe not this season, but next season. But eventually, but eventually the tree will, will bear fruit. Williams was talking to the journalist. Um, the club needs to know that. Obviously, the coach knows that. We know that as a team, we have we have lost so many experienced players this season. But we cannot dwell on that. We must just focus on the guys that are there, which are the youngsters. And some of them have done very well, says Mr. Mr. Ronan Williams. What's the take, guys, about Super Sport United? The, the issue of Super Sport United. Um, what's the take, guys? They seem to be producing young people, though. That's the brighter side of it. Né? They seem to be uh, so switched on in terms of constantly producing young people. And that's what I like about Super Sport United, together with Golden Arrows, in terms of, um, in terms of using young players. Né? And, and they, 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 they know how to do it. They, they, don't, they know when to introduce them. You know what I'm saying? That's what I like as well about, um, about the team like Super Sport United because you must look at the fact that they are using young players, but they are, they are still in the top eight. That's the, the funny part of it. Né? But a team like um, Golden Arrows at the, at the same time, they are also doing well because they are not in the relegation zone. I think they are sitting above 25 points if I'm not mistaken. So I can guarantee you that usually in the PSL, the team that with 25 points does not get uh, relegated. Usually the team that gets relegated is sitting on 21 points. You can go and check that in the five previous uh, seasons. Now you will notice that the team that usually get relegated is sitting on 21 points. So let's jump into Kaitano Tembo situation. He was asked about Benny McCart at, at, uh, at uh, Super Sport United and said, No man, there's Benny McCart coming to Super Sport. Uh, we have had something like that. And there's a response. I like it. He responded like by saying the following. I like the response. I like the response. Uh, sorry, sorry. Um, he responded ne? Mm, by saying, no, man, that's not my responsibility. My responsibility does not rest on who's coming to who's coming to Super Sport United to coach Super Sport United or not. But my responsibility is on the field. And at any time, anyway, a coach can be fired. No, it says, look, everyone, everyone knows that in the team is not it's performing um, not not necessarily to the full of their potential. That's what uh, the coach is saying, but. The coach simply stated that, no man, um, you know that the, as a coach, I cannot fire or hire myself. So it's not my responsibility to either hire or fire myself. It's a, it's a technical team. I mean, it's a management staff. So it's not mine. Do not ask me about Benny McCart coming to Supersport United. It is their business, not my business. 
Now, while we are in Pretoria, we decided to take a, a, a journey to Mamelori because Peter Shalulele has been considered the best striker by far in Africa. Yeah, man, have you heard that? The best striker by far in Africa. You really, 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 really want to know that? Now, oh well, Peter Shalulele man has been doing exceptionally well. So, Daily Sun has caught at this bar, has caught at this bar, has caught at this, or has got this to say. Um, Peter has done very good since he joined the club, and his look he, and his members speak of look and his numbers speak volume. Says Mangobam Nuti, he is one of the best scorer. But beside his scoring rate, Peter is one of the most professional player I have ever worked with. I think he's an exemplary player to any young players that wants to be a top footballer there is a lot to learn from him and now his career he, he, he and, and how he carries himself oh the humility that he has he has got such a good human mentality and makes him a, a, a best um, attribute, no, a best attribute possessed by a best player he has delivered two seasons in a row since he joined since he joined and become the most important player of Mamelo de Sundowns. And when you are the most important player in a team like Sundowns, then you have to be among the best in the continent. We believe Sundowns is one of the biggest competitors in the continent and Shalulele is one of the best player without doubt, says Manoba Mniti. We will not fall up, fall for that. You listen, okay? But let me let me not get into that, God. You know what I said. Uh, he said that him. Peter Shaluli is the best striker by far in the continent. I don't know. Do you have a debate? You have a debate that? Yeah, guys, it's your own business. But yeah, well, I wouldn't know if in the continent. But if you ask me about it, the PSL, then I can agree. I concur with you. Continent. Mm -mm. I, I, please write, I did not comment. Now let's jump into uh, another pirate defender, uh, Justin Shabalala has attracted interest abroad. There are so many teams that are looking to bring Shabalala at, uh, oh, from, uh, from uh, Orlando Pirate. Well, I don't know guys, um, what to take about the, contribut the contribution of Justin Shabalala at Orlando Pirate. Do you think he deserves to go far? Now, uh, interestingly, uh, Sakala Duma guys has gathered this for us about the issue of Kaza Chiefs and the PSL. The Super Sport United look. Um, in fact, Sakalatima has got some interesting facts to to, to to present to you. So I'm gonna read this for you. So Super Sport United, I've got the, I mean, Sakalatima has got this to say. They, there could be a delay in the conclusion of the 20, 20, 2021 and 2022 season following the confirmation that, that the Premier Soccer League is taking their dispute with Kaiser Chiefs to the Johannesburg High Court in the coming weeks. Now, here is an interesting fact. No date has been set, but Sakalatima has been informed that both parties are awaiting a special um, allocation for their matter to be heard urgently. Uh, the PSN is unhappy with the decision taken by the senior council um, Nazir to rule that the, the two games, um, the two games, chiefs abandoned from in the local okay, abandoned from in December last year against Captain City and Golden Arrows will be replayed. Um, Chiefs have initially asked uh, the league to postpone the five of their DSTV Premiership fixtures uh, that both due to an outbreak of coronavirus cases at Nature Ren, which sidelines players and technical staff members and management. But the interesting thing there uh, is what they're about to say. I like what I'm about to say. Um, the club has claimed that more than 50, uh, 50 people um, uh, had uh, had caught the virus. However, the PSL did not grant them the request and Chiefs did not show up for the two games. Although they did end up playing the other three games, the Sekukuna United, the Royal AM and the Marisbeck United before the Christmas break. Chiefs were subsequently charged by the PSL prosecutor Zolama Jabu, but asked for the matter to be referred to SAFA where, uh, where 
Qasim was appointed arbitrator and last month ruled in favor of the Glamour Boys following the several days of deliberation. It's now been confirmed to the CR crew that both the league and Chiefs have, have filed papers at the high, Johannesburg High Court. The former, I mean, the former seeking to have awarded the Qasim, um, the, the, the Qasim uh, reviewed and set aside because the PSL insists that COVID-19 should not be an excuse for cancelling games. Should the court not prioritize this case? This is where you come in, guys. This is so interesting, man. Should the court, should the court not prioritize this case? It is likely that the current campaign could drag on affect the final lock standing car may. That's a take. I'm gonna be here. God's willing, if I'm not dead. I'm gonna be reporting another one. Uh, but even even if the PSL wins that one, the Cubs Chiefs will still fight for another one. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be a battle. And I don't see how the PSL can win a case of COVID-19. I just don't see it happening. I just don't see it happening. But here our eyes, here is us. God's willingly, we will not be dead by then. So that will mean we will then have to witness uh, the case between Gaza Chiefs and PSL. So God's willingly, we're alive then. I'm going to do another video, but I'm going to tell you one thing. I do not foresee the PSL winning against Gaza Chiefs. I do not foresee that. But because I've got you, you've got an educated, educated opinion. Let's talk in the comment section below, guys. Until next time, take care.